The Lake Onion Dragons headed into the annual battle with their crosstown rivals, the Oxford Wildcats, with a 1 and 2 record. The Wildcats failed to score a point in their two losses. Could they turn things around in the battle for the double O trophy? Minutes into the first quarter, Lake Orion's Danny White hits running back Wyatt Harden, forcing the fumble. The ball is recovered by the Dragons' Drew Casey on their own 45 yard line. On the Dragons' first play from scrimmage, quarterback Caden Prescorn hands off to Keith Fields, and he's gone. Fields goes 55 yards for Lake Orion's first touchdown of the night. Caden Priestcorn was only two for four on the night, but one of those completions went to Jalen Wiggins for a 35-yard touchdown in the second quarter. The extra point was good. Lake Orion 14, Oxford 0. In the third quarter, with the ball on Lake Orion's 40-yard line, Keith Field breaks off another huge run to pad his stats. He goes 47 yards to Oxford's 13-yard line. Two plays later, Field finishes the drive with a 10-yard touchdown run with 10 minutes, 17 seconds left in the third. The extra point was missed. Dragons 20, Oxford nothing. Later in the third, Fields catches a pass from Priestcorn and takes it to Oxford's 21-yard line. <laughs> On the next play, Fields is tackled at the five to set up a first and goal. Fields makes it into the end zone for the third time. The two-point conversion attempt failed, but the Dragons were on their way to a route, 26-0 Lake Orion. Later in the third, the Wildcat punt is down by the Dragons on their own 42-yard line. Fields adds another 35 yards to his total of 207 yards on the night. Junior Chris Wilson got into the fun with a 23-yard touchdown of his own to put the Dragons ahead, 33-0. Wow. Coach Bell, who just joined the post-game program, Coach, great game. Thank you. 36-0, so yeah. always nice to hold the opponent to nothing. Absolutely. Talk a little bit about your feelings about tonight's performance. You know, Oxford gives you a good test because they're going to play old-fashioned power football, and we, you, know, you just don't see that as much. So we had to see if we could stand in there and give it right back to them, and the guys responded. You know, we bent a little bit early on defense, but we made plays and we kept them out of the end zone. And offensively, our guys are really starting to gel, you know, really starting to go. We were saying that the, the defense was almost like a bend but don't break defense against that power and dive they were running all night long. Is that a fair characterization? It is. It was. It's tough to defend. I mean, they just keep coming, and they're very good at what they do, and you just got to hang in there and hang in there and wear them down and, and I think we did that. So we're here with uh, with Keith Fields, the star of the night. I think we're going to call tonight the Keith Fields show. Multiple touchdowns, a lot of yards running between the tackles, some tough running yards against these Oxford Wildcats. Talk to us a little bit, Keith, about how you feel tonight's performance was for you and the team. I'm just glad we won the game, to be honest with you. Uh, we was one and two coming to the game. We lost to Troy Athens and Chippewa Valley against we still lost to. But I'm glad we won the game tonight. We got the trophy back. So that counts. That means a lot. So talk a little bit about your running style. My observation the past couple of years, you ran a lot of jet sweeps and had kind of on and off success. But this year you're running a lot more between the tackles and getting big chunks of yards and a lot more touchdowns. Talk about the difference for you in running that style. Uh, in practice, we do a lot of the inside, like dive and all that stuff, between tackles and stuff like that. So I just try to get bigger over the offseason and all that stuff. Not really. My lineman did a great job tonight, honestly with you. Honestly with you. My lineman did a great job. So tonight was an outstanding night for the Lake Orion Dragons football team, 36-0 against Oxford here at Dragon Stadium. Superb running by Keith Field, running tough yards between the tackles, but getting big chunks of yards and getting multiple touchdowns tonight. The defense was a bend but don't break defense, obviously holding Oxford to zero points, giving up a lot of yards and a lot of first downs in some cases, but not giving up any points, and that's really what matters in the end. Coach Bell seems to be happy with the performance. Keith Fields is happy with what he did, giving great credit to his offensive line but next week is a real challenge for the team against West Bloomfield a team that is highly talented plays a completely style of, different style of football from the Oxford team but I think the Dragons are up for the challenge they think that they're up for the challenge so we'll see how that goes down next week in West Bloomfield so from here at Dragon Stadium in Lake Orion Michigan for ONTV I'm Kevin McCormick thank you and have a great night